Hello, my name is Lorraine McArdle and I will be reading a poem for you called A Farewell to Hips. Uh, this poem was inspired by a dream sequence I created on the morning of my hip replacement surgery to help me navigate the difficult journey ahead. In the poem I talk about an Elephas Maximus, which is the Asian elephant with small ears, a Sobrani is a cocktail cigarette, and a waxing gibbous moon is when the moon is almost full. A Farewell to Hips When the surgeon's scalpel opened sesame, my arthritic hip was no longer there. I had removed it from the socket with kid gloves, filled two large glasses of Malbec, and talked over old times, reminisced over hip rolls, figures of eight under disco lights, sweating with Saturday night fever, dangerous driving down the jewel carriageway, coastal walks on cliff paths, shopping till we dropped on one side. When the bell tolled, I raised my right hip over the back of an Elephas Maximus and rode in weighted silence to the edge of the river where a walnut boat waited. I slid the mushroomed bone along purple velvet lining and laid it on a cream silk cushion stuffed with Hungarian goose down. Then filled a large glass of Hendrix gin and tonic for my former joint to sip on its journey. When I pushed the boat into copper waters, the chestnut tree wiggled its five-fingered leaves and dropped a few conkers. The willow did not weep, but swung its grassy skirts to a hula. And the sycamore, no longer ill, spread its palms wide like slices of fruit soda bread, while the ash, sophisticated and slender, lay back and smoked a sobrani. I watched the vessel disappear into its watery copse and stood on the footbridge, a gemmed elephant at my side, the waxing gibbous moon at my back and the autumn sun straight ahead, rising like a lucky penny.